What's up YouTube? It's your man, Big B Production 100. I have an awesome video for you guys today. Today in this short video, I'll be showing you guys of how you can get your RSS feeds back in OS 10 Mount Lane. Now you will notice when you first install Mount Lane that the button that you would normally have in your toolbar is gone. And that's because Apple has taken it away. So don't panic, don't freak out. That's why I'm here to show you how you can get your feeds back. There's two ways you can do this. So let's just say if you open up Safari and you notice that your button was gone. The first one I'm gonna show you how to get your RSS feeds back would be number one. You can simply just go to a web page that uh, has the feeds and uh, you can just type in uh, RSS feeds or whatever, just basically letting that website know that you wanna get those feeds from that website. And you should get like a little menu here that'll pop up inside your web browser and you will notice that it says RSS feed. Now, what that is, Apple is recommending for you to just go to the Mac App Store and either purchase an RSS feed or you can just download one for free. So just click on that button and you will notice that you will get this. No RSS reader is installed. That's fine, don't freak out. Search the Mac App Store. Once you search the Mac App Store, you will notice that you can get a bunch, I mean from free to the ones that you can pay for. Now, the one I use is actually the one right here, uh, Cappuccino, and it's rated at three stars out of 56 ratings, but it's, it's pretty cool, I love it, you know what I mean? It's, been working perfectly fine ever since I installed it, uh, which was like two days ago. Well, like a day ago, whatever, like that. When I installed it uh, on my line here, and it's been perfectly fine. So once you install that, you can then subscribe to all of your pages that you want to subscribe to and still get your RSS feeds. And again, keep in mind that's free. Or if you want, you can purchase one for ten dollars or five dollars, whatever you like. Okay. And the second way of, of course, it's would be. Okay. The second way of, of course, would be for me to put the link down below in the description on this website that you can actually go to and you can download the extension for Safari here. Therefore, you would get your RSS feed button back in your toolbar. This is your man, Big B Production 100. I sure hope you guys enjoyed this short video here. I hope it was very informative for you guys out there that was looking forward to getting your RSS feed button back in Safari that was panicking. Please rate, comment, and subscribe if you guys enjoyed the video, which I hope you did. Holla at you.